what's going on guys hope all of you guys enjoyed the new intro for the channel i love it hope you guys did too i wanted to bring you guys a different content today so let's get to it i ended up buying an elder mall yesterday and a lot of you guys know i own an ags as well i bought it yesterday and i logged off so i never really messed with it or played with it i don't even know how much i could hit so I wanted to pretty much compare these two handed weapons and tell you guys what I honestly think about them. Let's get straight into it. So the melee strength on the Elder Maul is plus 187 compared to the AGS melee strength which is 172. So by the looks of it, I should be roughly hitting 80s with the Elder Maul because for a fact I have specced 78 with the AGS fully parted, prayer, and maxed armors. Now the AGS does have better attack bonuses and prayer, but the Elder Maul <laughs> is just straight out looks like a beast. So let's see what I can hit with the Elder Maul and AGS. So far, I can't see how the AGS attack bonuses make a huge difference because of how consistent the spec is. But then, I can tell how I can definitely be hitting big hits with the Elder Maul because it's not consistent. But it's crushing a lot of big hits. It's hitting 50s, 60s so far. But it should be hitting closer to 70s at least to 75. But I'm not seeing any big hits like that so far. So hopefully we could still see more hits and this is my first time actually experiencing this with you guys it's honestly my first time using the elder mall so let's see how big i can actually hit i'm switching off uh, the topic here a little bit but a lot of people are asking me what i do outside of youtube uh this is a new channel so i'm not really having an income or anything i'm not really doing this youtube videos for income but i just love just playing this game and this is what I do best, uh, PKing and, you know, buying different weapons, having fun with them, staking. That's what I love doing. So I'm just making you guys some content so I could enjoy doing it myself and I can bring you guys some nice content, hopefully. But what I do outside of YouTube is pretty much social media. I'm an influencer on Instagram. I have over 1.2 million followers, business related, of course. And it's mostly automotive. Uh, my name is Chris and I am 26 years old. And I started doing Instagram about five years ago. So I do have a lot of experience with social media and uh, marketing. So I'm trying to get into the YouTube criteria of my knowledge of Instagram and YouTube combined. I think it could be perfect. But it's kind of hard, honestly. YouTube is way harder and way different than Instagram because in YouTube, you're actually kind of talking to your audience. And if you do bad videos, obviously no one's going to enjoy it. But again, in Instagram, it's always more consistent. People enjoy one niche, you know. But YouTube is pretty much the same way. For example, RuneScape is my niche, but it's such a different ball game to me honestly so hopefully in a few more months i'll get the hang of these videos and start making you guys even better videos than what i am doing now so hopefully you guys are enjoying the video right now honestly <laughs> i'm not liking this elder mall and i did end up paying close to 60 mil for it comparing to the ags which is only 28 mil I do some crazy specs with the AGS and if I want to KO someone, it's a crazy KO with the AGS. But so far with the Elder Mall, I'm really not digging it. I hope I did not spend 60 mil for no reason. I don't want to lose a couple mil just getting rid of it. But hopefully, if I start doing some bigger hits, it would be worth it. I guess just... a pretty much having the Elder Mall and saying, oh, I have an Elder Mall, I guess you could say that's the only cool part. But I'd rather have my, ooh, that was a nice 50. But I'd rather have my Dragon Claws that I actually won or actually someone pretty much gifted it to me. 
I'd rather have those dragon claws than having an elder maw for pretty much the same price almost. I don't know, we'll see. Please comment below in what kind of videos you guys want to see in the future. Do you just want to see me peeking? Do you guys want me to compare more weapons like this? Should I compare more armor? Remember, I can buy pretty much any armor. I can buy any weapons. So if you guys want to see someone kind of comparing apples to apples to different weapons to different armor, please let me know in the comments below. It would mean a lot and it will actually give me more ideas for future content. Also, please comment below in what are your thoughts on the AGS or the mall. Um, I personally do not like the mall so far, uh, but the AGS spec and the AGS in general for the price point and for what it is and giving you extra prayer bonus, I think is hella more worth it than the Elder Mall in my opinion. So please comment below in what you guys think. Hope you guys are enjoying the video so far. It means a lot to me if you guys can please hit the like button and subscribe and share. You guys are, you guys have made me speechless. I am still in shock that I've passed over 200 subs. I'm still going to do so many giveaways. Again, I am giving away 50 mil cash every Sunday. I already gave the first 50 mil last Sunday and NAR underscore T, he did contact me. So he did get his 50 mil cash. Congratulations, buddy. And hopefully the next subscriber will win 50 mil cash. Oh man, as you guys can see, the prairie bonus on the AGS is just out of this world. The attack bonus is out of this world. Yes, I understand the Elder Maul does have a plus 15 bonus, which has an advantage, but I'm not hitting anything. I can't hit. Jeez. I don't know what to say no more. <laughs> no, honestly, though, they're both good weapons. I love the AGS. AGS has always been my baby. The Elder Maul is something new. I mean, I'm going to try to see what else I can hit. I'm going to try to, you know, use different potions, use different armor. And I'm going to try to see if I could try to at least get close to 70s. I honestly haven't seen anyone even get close to 70s with the Elder Maul. With 4 PK use, having a whip and switching to Elder Maul and KOing someone, I understand that's good. But I'd rather honestly still use AGS or D Claws. By the way, that D Claws, that I Abyss Eye that he gave me is still in my bank. I love you, man. No homo. Thank you so much for that. It means a lot to me. But again, the AGS being 28 mil, I would buy all day over the Elder Mall. Elder Mall looks cool just because you have an Elder Mall and the way you run and the way you're holding the Elder Mall is only cool. But honestly, again, I do not like it. I might end up selling the Elder Mall if I don't even get close to 66 KOing or even get, or even hit a freaking 66. I can't even hit a 66. The max I've hit so far is a 61 with a 15 more strength bonus than a freaking AGS. Hmm, weird. By the way, guys, a lot of you guys say what my nationality is, the reason why I have the accent. I'm Lebanese Armenian, so if sometimes you guys don't understand me, I apologize. I apologize. Thank you guys so much for watching another video. If you guys want to see more videos like this, please let me know in the comments below. It does mean a lot. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. I'll catch you guys in another video soon. Peace out.